Prince Harry and Meghan Markle will reportedly not be accepting the Queen's invitation to stay at Balmoral. The royal couple are understood to think that Archie is still too young to make the trip up to Scotland. Her Majesty always asks her family to join her when she heads to her Scottish estate for her two-month summer break. Harry and Meghan had no plans to go to Balmoral this summer as they felt Archie was too young. It's a bit odd, as his age didn't stop them taking him to a visa for a week and then to see Elton John in France. If they want privacy or protection, which was, there is no more protected or private holiday destination than the Queen's Scottish home. It was previously reported it would be Meghan's first stay in Balmoral. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex could not attend last year as Meghan was in the late stages of pregnancy. Prince William and Kate Middleton were pictured taking a budget flight with their children to Aberdeen for their trip to Balmoral in late August. The Queen has also been spotted getting into her own vehicle to drive around the estate and Prince Philip was also seen out and about in the grounds of the castle with his daughter Princess Anne. Under fire Prince Andrew, Prince Edward, and Sophie, Princesses Eugenie and Sarah Ferguson have also visited in the last month. Balmoral Castle has been a residency of the British royal family since 1852. It sits on extensive grounds that cover an area of around 50,000 acres. As a working estate, it includes forestry and farmland as well as managed herds of deer, highland cattle and ponies. A spokesman for Buckingham Palace has been approached for comment. Harry and Meghan have snubbed the Queen by not accepting her invite to Balmoral. Her Majesty always asks all her family to her Scottish estate for her two-month summer holiday. But this year the Sussexes declined, saying four-month-old Archie was too young. William and Kate did go with their three children. A source said, Harry and Meghan had no plans to go to Balmoral this summer as they felt Archie was too young. It's a bit odd, as his age didn't stop them taking him to a visa for a week and then to see Elton John in France. Disappointed. If they want privacy or protection, which was Harry's excuse for taking private jets, there is no more protected or private holiday destination than the Queen's Scottish home. It's all very hunting, shooting, fishing up at Balmoral, so maybe that put Meghan off. She has never been to Balmoral and the Queen was disappointed they're not going. It had been widely expected that this summer would mark Meghan's first stay there. In an unprecedented royal snub. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have refused an invitation from Her Majesty the Queen to visit her while on holiday in Balmoral, Scotland. The monarch had asked the couple to join her at the legendary royal estate during her traditional northern summer break, but the embattled pair have stunned the Queen by declining, claiming that baby Archie, four months, is too young. In contrast, Harry's brother Prince William, with whom is said to be increasingly estranged, did agree to attend, bringing with him his three young children, Princess George and Louis, and Princess Charlotte, as well as wife Kate Middleton. Royal watchers have also noted that Archie's tender age didn't prevent him from recently visiting a number of celebrity hot spots. It's a bit odd, as his age didn't stop them taking him to a visa for a week and then to see Elton John in France, a source told British newspaper. If they want privacy or protection, which was Harry's excuse for taking private jets, there is no more protected or private holiday destination than the Queen's Scottish home. Now speculation is rising about what the couple's real motivation may have been for tuning down their request for a visit. It's all very hunting, shooting, fishing up at Balmoral, so maybe that put Meghan off, says the Sun's source. She has never been to Balmoral and the Queen was disappointed they're not going. The couple have never visited Balmoral together, as Meghan declined last year due to her pregnancy. Kate and William famously visited the estate via a budget airline flight, and even disgraced former royal Sarah Ferguson turned up, before doing a runner when her nemesis Prince Philip turned up unexpectedly early. Every summer the Queen spends her time at the lavish Scottish castle and has hosted many family and friends at the stunning property. Richard Fitzwilliams told, the Queen is able to relax there as the politicians to take a break. 
The country seems to be heading into political chaos which might involve the Queen and she, ever conscious of attending to her red boxes, will enjoy a well-deserved holiday as the Brexit storm clouds gather and October 31st looms ever nearer.